Okay, it is a monster song react. It's 27 minutes long. Right after this, we're going to do that. So, Spock's Beard, which is a band I've been getting to know, of course, through uh, Chosen Reacts by my Patreons, mostly. This one's Sidecar Dog and Woody. He wanted me to react to the great big nothing on the V album from 2000. This epic. It has to be an epic if it's 27 minutes long. It's uh, like a Greek tragedy about Neil Morse's friend, the late great Kevin Gilbert. Nobody has reacted to it yet. Whoa, okay. This is a YouTube uh, exclusive then. Word. Okay. <laughs> stuff. Pretty. Her face sounds sick.
how the bass player was playing in that previous section there he was going down to low E sort of contrary to what everything else that was going on it sort of it made it a different G-sharp, how do they do that? Big stretch. So like a washing machine, <laughs> industrial size, that's some empty home washing machine. Oh yeah, suddenly it's kind of a fusion-y jazz, jazz, as in G-A-Z-Z, jazz. Fun bass line, great solo. Sort of reminds me of uh, is it Tony Banks or Peter Banks? No, Peter Banks is guitarist. Tony Banks is Genesis guitar uh, keyboardist. Who's a yes early keyboardist? No 
no, it's Tony K. I was trying to think of. Sorry. The organ reminds me of Tony K. The early yes keyboards who came back in from 90125. <laughs> of like Jeffrey no
To me, this is kind of Beatles-esque in a way, a little bit. sudden there's an African flavor here in that drum rhythm. Isn't that African? And now it's something different. guitar solo here.
This reminds me of Saga.
that certainly was a masterful finale. That was really beautiful. Uh, the way they summed up the whole piece at the end. Da 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 da. da. <laughs> pretty melody um it was an extremely eccentric track i mean the whole song is a whole 20 minutes 27 minutes and uh certainly it kept moving being the first time i heard this song i think it sounds like a song i would have to hear it again a few times to digest it it's a different vibe of a song totally than closely edge for example it, it sounded more super trampy you know beatles uh you know um Abbey Road album kind of you know like uh, when they would string some of their songs together but it's also kind of a an experiment too right I, mean, I did enjoy the song there uh, especially the end that's really stuck with me it's still singing I'm singing it in my head still that sort of that finish so that's my react thanks for watching I'm Dean and make sure you watch some other videos I'll put some videos right here on the screen talk to you later spiraling up bye now